What is up, you guys? It's Bulgy98, and in this video, we have so much to talk about, including Modern Warfare 3 and Laura Croft coming to Call of Duty in general. Let's hop into it. Yes, so right off the bat, we do have a new operator coming as a collab. It is Laura Croft from Tomb Raider. Yes, so Laura Croft should be coming soon. Season 5 reloaded for the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 season, but this doesn't exclusively me Modern Warfare 2 because as we know the carry forward's coming so that means we actually will be able to use her in Modern Warfare 3 as well which is super cool but hopping over to Modern Warfare 3 we actually see a new weapon UI so it looks like this is what the loadout is going to look like it looks pretty much the exact same identical to Modern Warfare 2 maybe a couple of tweaks here and there but nothing too different and of course we see the G36C just named a little different but it looks like the loadout UI is going to be pretty much the same from what we see in Modern Warfare 2 which I mean the weapon loadout UI will wasn't that bad in Modern Warfare 2 in my opinion. It was just mainly the lobby loadout. Then we can also see a mission here where we see Verdansk, uh, the dam from the original Warzone map, which is a little weird because it just kind of shows that Verdansk is coming, but in the form of campaign only. It does not look like we will be getting Verdansk Warzone again, except for Warzone Mobile, you will be able to get it. Um, here's what we look like our Verdansk looks more this looks like Verdansk but not really like I never really saw this in Verdansk so I think this is actually part of our Warzone map that we'll be getting so you can see it kind of is like Verdansk it's not too far off but it's just not the actual exact Verdansk replica map which as much as people don't like the fact that we're getting a new map I think it will be better for us to get a new map also here's another picture at the airport from Verdansk uh, which is in the Modern Warfare 3 campaign, but I do think that as much people want the old map to come back I think it's good to keep getting something new because as much as we want the old stuff to come back We're gonna get tired of playing old things We're gonna say that it was all copy and pasted with new movement and we'll just blame it on something else that they did So I'm glad that they're giving us something new This is actually an image from the Warzone map coming to Modern Warfare 3 or I mean coming to Warzone 3 or Warzone 2 whatever you want to call it Warzone the new map that is in that image is from that so we can kind of see that we do have a Verdansk feel to the map so I'm super excited to play it and try it out I really think a lot of people who are wanting Verdansk are going to be happy with it because it does seem to be not identical but closely relative and I want to know what your guys thoughts on that especially my warzone players who play warzone a lot are you excited do you think the new map is better or do you think the old map is better I'm interested to know these are all just my opinions on whether or not old maps are you know better or new maps are better so let me know down below what you guys think I just think keeping it fresh it probably be better to go with a full new map but then again it's been a while since we played for dance just like it's been a while since we played the 2009 modern warfare 2 map so Maybe it wouldn't hurt to get it back, but let me know what you guys think. Maybe a special, like, mode, like, you know how we have Bondale now? Maybe we have Verdansk as its own mode. Like, we have Verdansk, and then we have whatever the new map is going to be called. So we could have multiple ways to play within the game, if that makes sense. If not, then don't worry about it. Just let me know if you would rather have a new one or Verdansk, the original Verdansk. Um, thank you guys so much for the support on my last few videos. The COD content is kind of leak, like kind of dry. I mean, I could talk about skins and stuff, but I really want to bring on the new stuff I can to you guys. So I try my hardest to find some things. But we are just getting closer and closer to this, you know, this drop day. So right now we're just looking a little, you know, dry on leaks and stuff because everything that has came out is the same thing we kind of already predicted or put in videos so I don't want to remake these videos if that makes sense so I try to find new things every video I can uh, so I appreciate you guys sticking it out with me we are so close to 700 subscribers I think we are now less than 70 subs away so I appreciate you guys so much for that help if you guys do like other content go to more multi 98 he's a featured channel on my YouTube page um, I basically post siege mainly on that so I appreciate it if you guys go check it out, but thank you, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know down below what you're excited for in Modern Warfare 3. We have old maps. We now have a new Warzone map. We have Verdansk coming in campaign mode. Are you excited for campaign? Are you excited for all these new things coming? Let me know down below. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, and thanks for watching.